Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Dust, an Elysian Tale. Oh, oh, oh crap, oh, sh oh shoot, okay, alright, um, yo, um, can you say unfair? Get wrecked. Anyway, um, oh, that's been taken care of. Uh, today? We discovered a beautiful yet dangerous underground world. We're going to travel deeper to learn why those monsters attacked Aurora. Jesus Christ, that was just... That was a bit much, wouldn't you say? I also keep forgetting to... Wow, really though? But I keep forgetting to have a uh, stopwatch at the ready for part length. Death was imminent. Though well, I probably could have saved that health. Pretzel. Healing item. Oh, that's alright. We got another one. Fidget had the little chest icon over her head. That's why I'm like... Is there an item nearby? <coughs> One can hope. Though it doesn't look like that was the case. Okay. Oh, really? Is there about to be an uh, interruption already? Thought I actually had time. To record. Guess not. Whatever. What's going on down here? Oh god. I love that fire attack. Because I immediately get hit. I guess we go down? Oh, there was a key. Y'all didn't need to come back. Yeah, I, I can't make that. Am I gonna get like a double jump or something? Hmm. See, the drums are going. This has me suspicious. I do want that key, though. Never mind. So far, nothing. Wait a minute. Oh, God. Well, at least I got a level up. Um, yeah, sure. So I've got to use the power of air currents. Muting momentarily. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, so that worked. But how do I get the key? Oh, three? <sighs> Not like that. Oops. Oh my god. <laughs> and it's that simple. Might as well. I'm gonna assume I have to wait until I learn how to crawl to get in there and get that, uh, well, those three keys. And over here. Oop, cutscene. Oh, Dust, no. Wait. This creature is too well defended for a straightforward assault. We'll see about that. Oh, okay, that was a bad idea. It is practically invulnerable unless you stun it with a parry, like so. Dust, would you like a refresher on parrying? Uh, I don't need one, but for the people at home, please explain. Attack and hold X at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their move, opening them up for a counterattack. Timing is crucial, and you must be facing your opponent. A successful parry may daze your opponent, and will fully restore your energy meter. You will be unable to harm certain enemies unless they are dazed. This is one such creature. Okay, I'm gonna assume it's Exercise just for all the tankies. And your opponent's pattern, and you will emerge victorious. Well, that did nothing. Oh, he had like no HP. Okay, I was expecting like mini boss. Get red. Okay. More cuts. Oh, look at him. And he's afraid. Whoa, not sure, but it sure did run off in a hurry. Probably because your peoples killed his peoples back in the day, and you kind of forgot about that. Oh god. I did not stop at any store when I got back to Aurora. I could have dropped off these uh, blueprints. Oh well, oh my god. Another save point. Done up there. Maybe I am. Oh, no. Nope. Yeah, XXY is a ridiculously overpowered simple combo. It's cheese.
Like, that's ridiculous. Is there gonna be a big guy down here? I thought I felt a vibration. Well, I mean, it is big. Ooh. Okay, gotta watch out for poison. Cinnamon bun. I could go for one. As I slowly make my way back up. I keep thinking it's gonna heal me like all the way. <laughs> Also double check to make sure I am in fact recording. <laughs> Big Spider is not to be underestimated. That's the word. Wait. Let's follow him. And take a mushroom while we're at it. I'm sure he didn't jump up here. I just want to see what this leads to. Just curiosity. Oh God. Also, sorry if you can hear loud noise in the background. <laughs> Oh my god, it's like, if I record at night, I have to contend with my own, like, fatigue. And if I record during the day, I have to deal with background noise. I don't want my videos to be bad. <laughs> okay. But it's like... Do you really need to what yell on the this? phone? <laughs> You've been poisoned. Yeah, I kind of figured that. When you're poisoned, your life slowly drains down to nothing. If you don't take care of it soon, death is inevitable. I can probably just wait it out. Stop pretending you're so tough. Here, take this mushroom. It'll stop the poison for now. You can thank me later. Okay. Oh, I got plenty. There we go. Uh, I accidentally set that as my, uh... <laughs> did not mean to do that. Like, really, I can hear the conversation in, like, two rooms over clear as day. I really hope it's not bleeding into the microphone. Considering I'm wearing soundproof headphones, and I can hear it, it probably is. I'm sorry, everybody. Well, maybe he did go that way. Oh. Yeah, he probably did. So then what was over here? Or was that like that... Like... Vine on the wall... Yeah, it's pr all right. Fair enough. Then I'm not gonna worry about that just now. Like I settled on there being like one big exploratory part where I 
do quests and stuff. So there will always be more time for exploring later on. But even with the quests, they don't seem to be all that bad. It just seems to be like simple, like, oh, go here, thing. Like, nothing too time consuming, nothing too difficult. Such a good combo. Hello. Yeah, those guys are easy. <laughs> More intimidating than anything. And they're even not all that intimidating. They're just big. Big doesn't always equate to intimidating. Like, look at the Michelin Man. He's big, but he's not really intimidating. He's just a big old mushroom boy. That'll work. Eat my dust. Get it? Get it. Do you get it? Oh, you get it? You're just not laughing? Okay. Anyway. Easy. Jellyfish are no match for me. Oh, giant spider. Just gotta remember my dash. Just gotta remember my dash. And my spells. I do keep forgetting about the spells. Key. Oh, sheep! You got a little sheep over here. Oh, innocent, just being a sheep and junk. I like sheep. They just mind their own business, just being all sheepy and like just eating grass and getting dirty. I have no idea where I was going with that. There, there was no punchline there. I, I just like sheep. I blame Babe. Like watching Babe a lot as a kid. It also made me really want a pig too as a pet. No! Go away! There he goes. Forget him. Take a look around. There's something horribly wrong with these mushrooms. These aren't mushrooms, Fidget. They are called bubble sprouts, and it would be wise for us to tread lightly around them. They react rather explosively to movement. Oh. Wonderful. I wasn't even moving. Okay. okay. All right. I'll just be quick. Ouch. Oh wait, blue is good. It is. I'll take it. Admittedly, I don't really know where I'm going. Shop. So, you have slain the one known as Fuse. I had no choice. He'd lost his minds, murdered many innocents. I am not judging, friend. His death was sad, but necessary. Forgive me for asking, but are you a Moonblood? The Moonbloods. They are an ancient race. And their presence is not tolerated in these lands. One would be at a 
disadvantage among so many warm-blooded creatures. I understand. I believe you do not, my friend. But I will not press the matter if you do not. Is shopkeep gonna turn out to be low-key evil? Because I don't really want that. Hmm. Two attack, four defense, one luck. I'm good. I mean... Oh wait, I got one of those in my... Yeah, let me get one of these then. Everything else I'm good on. Transaction is most appreciated. Watch your back, my friend. Yeah, shopkeep acting a little suspicious. A little suspicious indeed. Oop. Okay. Everything else seems to be fine. I mean, I got two of those rings because they're just that good. All right, that'll work. Based on where we are, I think we're right outside a boss room. But there's still about like, you know, there's still plenty of time left before we hit like 30 minutes or so. I think I'm gonna go for it as I go in the opposite direction. Okay. I'm gonna mute for a moment too. Okay. Yeah, it would just rather not. Like. I really need to talk to, wow, my mom about having loud conversations just standing in the hallway. Like, you don't need to do that. There's other rooms. I also need to figure out how to word that in a way where I would not be, uh, let's say be, be killed. It was like a mix of be and get. I'll figure something out. Alrighty. Yeah, let, let's... As I continue to not go in the direction of the boss. Or maybe I am. There he is! Look, he's in trouble! Ah! Leave me alone! Taking on little ones, huh? You will most definitely regret meeting me. Keep wary of the bubble sprouts, Dust. Where this battle will be over before it begins. They don't do that much damage. Oh god. Oh, there's another one? Alright, he got me, he got me. I ain't gonna lie. I might be a little overpowered. <laughs> goes again. You're welcome, kid. Come now, Dust. He's obviously terrified. Let's go find him and maybe get out of this raining death. It's not even that bad. The, the ogre did more damage than the bubbles. Sheep! 
Oh, a new town. Mud Pot. Amazing name. Wrong button. All right, well, we in Mud Pot. I didn't think those monsters were smart enough to build a fence. I'm certain they didn't. Let's hop on over. And activate, like, some security system. Or not. I'm not going to hurt the sheep. The only sheep I hurt are in Spyro the Dragon. Thank you very much. There he is! Your father's done gonna have himself a heart attack after he hears about this. I'm sorry, Mama. Goodness, what would I do if you'd gotten yourself hurt? Ah, Mama, look! The things must have followed me! How'd they jump my fence? Oh my Crafty god. Crafty vermin, those surface dwellers. She does see that I can fly, right? I'll be sure to tell her, Fidget. I'm sure that'll clear things right up. And the fence was only like two and a half feet? Back! Back, you beast! I got this ear spoon and I ain't afraid to use it! Psst. We aren't here for trouble, ma'am. In fact, we just saved your son. Huh? What are they talking about, Bobo? Um, well, they have been following me for a while. What? How far out did you go? I may just save the spoon for you. Uh, I'm sorry. We just came down from the surface to... Do I look like some country bumpkin to you? Of course you're from the surface. I think I'd remember seeing a talking, flying weasel cat thing down here. I think we got off on the wrong foot here. My name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Some creatures attacked a village above these caves, and we're trying to figure out why. Attacked a surface village, you say? Well, if that don't beat all, we underground folk tend to keep to ourselves. Got enough problems of our own already. I'm sorry to hear that. Actually, what I'm saying is, we got enough problems of our own without you surface folk bringing all that nonsense down here. So, if you don't mind... Come on, Dust. We're obviously not wanted here. Wait! That's enough, Bopo! You ought to get back to your chores before I take out the spoon again! Mama, I've seen them fight! They even got themselves a talking sword! I bet they could help! Young man, I don't care if their sword spouts rainbows and bowls of delicious baked beans. I don't want their help! Stop saying that! Pa's gonna die if we don't do something! Die? What's going on? Well, our healing wells have gone and run dry. And my pa's done gotten real sick. That's why I went out. To find some more of that water. I hate saying it, but it's true. See these mud pots lying around? Normally they're bubbling to the brim with mineral water. But just a few weeks ago, they dried up to nothing. But that still don't excuse you from putting yourself in danger like that! I may not be able to help your father, but I sure as heck ain't gonna lose you too! Mama! I wonder if those monster attacks on the surface could be related to your wells drying up. I wouldn't be at all surprised. It's been a couple weeks since the water dried up, but every creature here is feeling the effects. I'll bet those creatures broke through to the surface looking for more water. Mama! Maybe these two can go talk to the lady. The lady? Oh, she's a sweet old soul. Lives deep in the caves, makes the waters flow. She doesn't show herself around here too often, and we can't actually go see her on account of all the nasties living between here and there. In that case, I'll go speak with this lady and see why she stops the flow of water. You do that? This can't all just be a coincidence. The attacks on the surface, your wells drying up, I'm certain this lady must know something about what's going on. Well then, I had you folks pegged all wrong. If you aim to help my husband, I promise not to clock you with my wooden spoon of justice. Um, thanks? So, you're heading down to talk to the lady now? You'll help my pa? We'll do our best, Bopo. Just don't go running off again. You got my word. I mean, she was, like, mad rude for someone that, like, ooh, I don't know, saved her son. Yeah, he looking sick. He's sleeping peacefully. Let's leave him alone. Yeah. <laughs> 
Sorry, just had to practice my dashing in front of the sick person. But all right. We now have a new quest. We're going to speak to the lady and might as well get a oh, side quest. It's a pretty kitty cat. <laughs> what, me? It's a flying cat. Oh. She's not a cat, little girl. She's a... Oh, I don't even know what she is. I'm not a cat, you dolt. I'm a nimbat. Is that what you're called? A nimbat? Yes, hello. My name's Fidget. Maybe we've met? Can I hold it? I want it. Just do something! It's trying to grab me with its little child hands! Don't worry, Fidget. Sorry, um, um what's your name? Smobop. <laughs> well, Smobop, I'm sorry, but as much as she might look like one, Fidget is not a toy. Hey! Oh, I want her! She talks! I'll trade you. Look, I've got this box thing. Hey, Dust, look! That must be Reed's box! Hmm, tell you what. Next time I go to the surface, I'll see if I can find a suitable replacement. Then we'll trade. Phew, good idea, Dust. You know, that shop in Aurora had some things. Maybe the shopkeeper could figure something out for us? Yeah, maybe he can make us some kind of fidget doll for her. After all, she's far too young to take care of a pet like you. <laughs> yeah, way too much responsibility for... Hey! Oh, I hate the kid's name. Smobop? What? What? No. Oh. Why would you name your child that? Also, ugh, wrong button. Lady is going to be down and to the left. Down and to the left. Yeah, I'll talk to like everybody next time. Just trying to get to a save point. And there happens to be one here, allegedly. But yeah, they were very, very rude for someone who just, you know, saved the day. But it'd be what it'd be. You can't teach good manners, I guess. Did you just... Mm -hmm. Did you just put that thing in your inventory? Breaking the fourth wall, Fidget. Yeah. What? Okay, then. It's a gappy sheep. Oh, what a gappy's lost fly. Okay. But yeah. Just trying to get to a save point. Hmm. Wherever one may be. Are you kidding me? Oh, crap. <laughs> I did not do that on purpose. Okay, you have to wait for him to like... Yeah. The jump is not as instantaneous. Okay. There we go. Yeah, next time, we're gonna go find the lady. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. See you next time for some more Let's Play Dust an Elysian Tale. Goodbye. I just wanna see. Alright, 16%. Let's go.